The activity that we're going to do now is called Desktop Garden. It's been adapted by The Gardening Book, written by Jane Bull. This activity lets every student learn about what's going on in the garden right at their own desks. This is a great way to introduce students to the idea of plant growth and the food that we eat. The materials that you need for this activity are very simple and can be found at your local grocery store. All you need is a shallow lid. We used a soup lid that can be bought at Smart and Final. Paper towels, tin foil, water, and of course the seed. We used mustard seed because those germinate quickly. So for this activity, you're, you can introduce the theme by talking to your students about what plants need to grow. So we're going to be setting up in the ideal, or one way that plants can grow, by taking your soup lid and lining it with the paper towel. So tell your students to fold it up and make sure that it fits in, in the towel, or I'm sorry, in the paper lid. If there are any holes, just make, those, make sure that those are covered up. All right. So once you have the paper towel in the lid, you're going to take some water and have your students lightly moisten the whole lid. We don't want any water that can be dripped out because that'll drown the seeds. Um, so just make sure that the entire paper towel is moist. All right. After that, you're going to have your students take some of their mustard seed and sprinkle them into the lid. Tell them they can move them around so that way they don't have too many seeds in one spot. So make sure that you get that covered. That can take about 40 to 50 seeds, depending on how big the lid is. Okay, so once your seeds are on the paper towel in the lid, what we have to do is we have to block the sunlight so that the seeds can germinate. So you're going to take your um, tin foil and make sure that you get the whole thing covered up. All right, well now you have your desktop garden. You're going to have your students check these gardens every day. You can either have them stick them on the, corner, the top corner of their desk, or you can have them all put them on the windowsill. If you have your students put them on the windowsill, make sure that you have them write their name on the top. So that way they can tell which one is theirs at the end of the day. So you can put your name and the date and stick them on the, on the windowsill. You should see germination in about three to five days. Not only is this activity great for students to see how seeds germinate and how plants grow, you can also link it to other California state content standards. You can link it to math, by doing percentages of the amount of seeds that germinate, by charting the growth of the seeds on a daily basis, or you can link it to language arts by having your students keep a journal of the changes from day to day of their seeds, or they can write a creative story about the seeds that they're growing. This activity can be found on the California Foundation for Agriculture in the Classroom website at www.learnaboutag.org.